there's no one should be right down the way you start spawning. You uh, wait, and spot. Paolo is always like so scared. <laughs> yeah, no, no one is, should be bottom uh, left of yes. the map. And you really should need to give them your vision. <laughs> I don't if think I need. Uh, well, I can give them uh, my, my vision, I mean. But I'm just missing the play uh, one player's vision, and that is U8. Alright. Good luck, have fun. Uh, how big did I make? What do you mean? Oh, I got it. Alright, we are watching the game. We have uh, U8 over here in a white, playing the uh, a lot of humans. And he's partnered with yellow Mr. Paolo and black Flampest. And they are going to be facing Madluster in purple. Um, Max in green and slow mage in blue. And look at that, Black is trying to get his units to pop inside over here. That'd be fun. Yeah, sorry about the sneezing. Still a little bit here. And a bit of a wall up here from U8. I'm not too fond of that world because the catapults from enemy can actually reach pretty hard. Hard down there. Oh, this is not being repaired. This is gonna fall. Gold mines are pretty big, but not too big. I mean, now 50k. Oh, Yak Yak Gaming, thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm glad, I'm glad you're having a good time watching us play the Warcraft 2. Look at you were trying to protect his Badista here from the ground, but it will survive, it will survive, good, good stuff. Now he's defending his partner here, it's the yellow, and we have a pretty neat top versus bottom matchup. Defending the border here. But he has a peon coming in. He's really targeting that one ballista. It's like it's got a sliver of health. That's, a, that's about it. They are massing quite an army here, but uh, 
Yeah, you and Steam don't see it. You cannot see it, of course. You don't know what's up there. Such a big wall off. And we're just cleaning off all these towers. Oh, it's gonna lose the one catapult. Yep. Rip. Now the peon's gonna work on the second one. <laughs> Okay. Yellow is, is kind of building up. Three Raxes. The Ballistas are a bit far to defend against that uh, attack from the Grunts here. Will they manage to out damage the, the repairs on these three peons? Probably not. I mean, four, four Grunts, three peons usually is good enough. Peons should be able to defend it. Unless the full attack upgrades. Up in. And in they go. Catapult's gonna go, go down, but no, the ogres, the grunt, I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah okay, Ballista will go down. Nice sap. Pretty dangerous sap, too. And that's a lot of grunts from Fowlo. Which is exactly what you want. It's good protection. We have some uh, some footmen from Slow Mage, but they did not participate in the attack, and that's going to be a problem. Now we have level four grunts. So Mage is only level two, so he's far behind in upgrades. That's gonna that's gonna really not pay. I mean, he's a bit lucky that those guns were damaged, but uh, yeah, catching up with the upgrades, still far behind. u has got the castle, so I'm expecting some mage towers, but I don't see them. We have a... Oh, is that Flampers going for the two holes? Okay, Flampers going for a second hole over there. And uh, so Mage has not started dueling himself. To be honest, considering the amount of gold they have, I would say... Either purple or green should get it. Green is gonna have a hard time moving out with all of his peons, but maybe purple can get it easily. So purple has the ogres, he's got the alchemist, the goblin alchemist there. And there you go, the mesh tower. I was expecting it. I was expecting that mesh tower. Two mesh towers actually. Uh oh. Is attacking the, the blacksmiths like only slow mage would do. Got the blacksmiths, that's not bad. I mean, technically, that's value. Not bad. That blacksmith will have to be rebuilt. If they wanted, they could try and double sap. If they make two saps, they can sap here and here, and then get in there and kill uh, and kill Paolo. Because Paolo is almost walled up on the left side, it's gonna be hard for them to get there. That's what I would consider if I was in their team, in the team of Slow Mage and uh, Mad Luster. If I was Mad Luster, basically that that would be my course of action. I would have seen the wall over there. I would have seen all of that, and I would be okay. Two two saps, and I get in and basically snipe the only Orc player on their team. But it's not what Madlesset looks to be doing. Okay. Okay, that's good. I mean, he got a mage, but it's gonna, it's gonna be rewarded, unfortunately. That wall here, the invisible color, Lampist, with the support of the mage from uh, from uh, U8, is trying to burst in, and he's gonna manage. And 
is in. Just like that. Kind of find the, ba ba the base of Slow Mage opened, and Slow Mage won't be able to defend against this, that's too much. The duel from Flamp is paying off. That's a beautiful result from the from U8 here. Getting most of the peons of uh, of Max. Sneaky sneaky. Flamp is doing good. U8 also gonna try to get some some of the juice from the extra gold mine. Yeah, that, that catapult is dead. There you go, boom. All of them attacking from the left side into Flempest, but they don't have the numbers, no the tech. We've got level 6, we are researching loss when, uh, for Mad Blaster. We have a mage from Slow Mage too. Last is on the play. The bottom side has only one old player. It's not last yet. The mages are doing a great job though. They are really useful this game. There's still that big gold mine that hasn't been touched yet. From that range, he could reach here actually. If he really wanted to. But there's no more peons from, uh, from yellow. And uh, we have level 7, we have a uh, last actually from, from uh, Paolo. No, don't, don't say that early, you have like a few ogres that are not lasted in there. Oh, what a mess. Okay, he's gonna go in. A lot of damage from Blizzard, but uh, that's gonna be alright, I suppose. Max says he's dead. Madister with the last remaining ogres. <laughs> it's a little bit too much on his plate right there. Just uh, some good blizzards from uh, from Slow Mage. Very beautiful duel from uh, Flampus really paid off. I'm quite surprised no one on their team tried to do it. Lampus looking good in this game. Yeah, that's the last mage from... Uh, oh, not the last one, okay.
that's a green peon in there. A green peon that decided that he would not leave the gold mine ever. That would be his new home. He would hide in there. G G. It's a slow mage now. Wow, that footman got the two knights. <laughs> Uh, GG Not bad, not bad <laughs>